Bitcoin Lightning, Bitcoin Silver, Bitcoin God, Bitcoin Uranium, Bitcoin Cash, Super Bitcoin. You may have heard these names more than once, but do we really understand what they mean? Let's figure it out. Bitcoin is a network based on a blockchain. Imagine the blockchain as a train and the cars are the blocks that go consecutively one after the other. Blocks store the information about the transactions like cars have passengers. Then the locomotive of the train is an algorithm that forms this blockchain. And the drivers are the Bitcoin miners. Miners are responsible for creating new blocks and making transactions. This is what they charge fees for. But as Bitcoin becomes more popular, there are more and more people wishing to make transactions. Unfortunately, our old train is not ready for that amount of passengers. Of course, the community of the train enthusiasts is trying to solve this problem. Soft fork is a reversible change of the current network compatible with the existing blocks. Bitcoin soft forks have already happened many times. Unfortunately, these small updates don't make the situation better. There are still a lot of people who want to make transactions as quickly as possible. One way to make transactions faster is to increase a fee. But everyone in the community will be disappointed. It will negatively affect the popularity of trains. How to solve this problem? Segwit 2X, hard fork. The new train has arrived. Forget the old one. Increased blocks and other charms of life. Choose the future. Choose Segwit 2X. Hard fork is a serious change in the whole network that is not compatible with the old rules. In case of hard fork, the new network is created. It exists independently from the old one. Super Bitcoin Fork, Bitcoin Lightning, Bitcoin God, Bitcoin Silver, Bitcoin Uranium, Bitcoin Cash Plus, and long-awaited Segwit 2X. The new trains are just forks. They're based on Bitcoin technology and they do have some improvements. They will exist independently from the old main train and will just go on their way. Too many forks? What's the difference? Cointelegraph has prepared a detailed analysis of all current forks. Click on the link below the video or click on the logo on the screen 